It is so beautiful in here and it's just a few minutes away from the city. Look. Hmm. There is my son complaining. Oh my god. This is what I like about Cebu that like um, it's full of stunning and beautiful beaches and islands nearby and the water is so clear and on the other hand there is a lot of mountains what did you say flower you have flower <laughs> what color is that white white flower <laughs> my favorite with sauce of course and so yeah wait Nico. so this is mint F smell very fresh mint so i will put it in my tea five six seven eight <laughs> When we were in seventh grade You knew every crush of mine We'd always talk all night And now that we're all grown up You've disappeared for a while I wish that I knew why It's been about six months Did you forget about our plans To see each other soon? Cause I was fine now Just to see you So today uh, our little Filipino Russian family are going for a short uh, road trip and um, I will take you guys with us I want to show you uh, today why another reason why I love uh, Cebu so much because uh, you will see later on but um, yeah this is one of the reasons why I really enjoy living in Cebu I'm afraid that I lost you I hate we grew apart and never said goodbye Maybe we both just needed space Maybe a different time and place What if we could just rewind? I think it's been about six months Did you forget about our plans To see each other soon? Cause I was flying out just to see you in the middle Say hi to mama. <laughs> All right, so we are now in Busai, in a um, place named Shirao, Little Amsterdam, or Flower Garden, and it is so beautiful in here. And it's just a few minutes away from the city. Look. We came here and then uh, the rain started but it's okay because it's not so hot at least because I think that it's, if it's sunny here it's uh, very bright and hot and look the sky is so dark as if the cloud is above right above our heads no so mm -hmm. the sky Mikhail <laughs> so the entrance here I think it's 70 or 100 pesos only so like below than two dollars and it's very beautiful in here so many flowers Look at this view. Mm. Hmm. There is my son complaining. Oh my god.
ships don't stay the same. <laughs> so what love how you like in here? That's fine. How about the is it long, is it long time at this place in Cebu or Bye -bye. Like? Not not so long. But it's very popular in, uh, for the tourists, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, even now we're here. There is actually a lot of tourists so, yes. from different countries. Yes, what, Mikhail? Your flower? We will get another flower. Don't worry. I will get a new flower. Wait, I will get a new one. Okay. Mm. After rain, the uh, the it's very fresh. Looks so nice. Mm. You've got a new flower. Let me see. The show. The orange. Mm. Oh, I look at this place, it is so beautiful, so many flowers. Yeah, this is what I like about Cebu, that like um, it's full of stunning and beautiful beaches and islands nearby and the water is so clear and on the other hand there is a lot of mountains so you can spend time also in the mountains and it's not far from the city. So it is very cool, that's why I love Cebu so much. It's a lot in there actually. I cannot see them because they're yellow. We long, long nose, love. They're drinking the nectar. Let's the, the, yeah, it's one called Love, look, flying and drinking. Where is it? Are there? This is so unusual, no? It's like wild nights, not in the corn, no? In the nature, on the eating. riding in the uh, mountains of Cebu in Busai and then it was a very strong rain suddenly started like a thunderstorm but it's like uh, not in every area so um, it was rainy and then we passed by it was not rainy so we decided to stop here in this uh, cafe named Charlie's Cup and it is so beautiful and here I will show you now the view you see here this is all the mountains behind me and this is glass so that's why it's a glass house. It's all made of glass on the tree. Made on the tree. Yes, Mika, what do you want to tell? Come here. Yes. I'm hungry. You're hungry? Yes. So we decided to take a, a stop here while waiting for the rain and we will um, eat something uh, which is uh, like very popular for this cafe. The uh, Filipino, uh, Filipino food, like breakfast. I will show you what we will eat. And it's one of my favorites, so yeah, we'll uh, have a lunch here and coffee break.
the, they are called um, big breakfast so this is Hungarian sausage and then there is rice and then there is then ghee my favorite with sauce of course egg and then this one it's called unicorn unicorn juice now there is like strawberry and blueberry with milk you will eat Mikael? Mikael is eating chicken nuggets from McDonald's no Mikael? that's your favorite? chicken nuggets? ah you were eating in the car okay there is our dad is come yes what do you, what do you want to tell to dad um? Okay, we're eating a chicken nuggets. So yeah, and this is the second one. So we, we took same with my husband. This is for Mikhail's rice and coffee, of course. Mm -hmm. Alright, so it's already evening and we are on the way to uh, the city from the mountain part of Cebu and um, we stopped by here in the um, uh, in some place to buy the fresh vegetables from the farmers in the mountains because uh, the vegetables here are usually it's more profitable price and then also they're very fresh because they're just right from the farm here uh, usually if we're passing by here we're always stopping to buy some fresh veggies so I also wanted to go um, to search and to show you but my um, baby is sleeping so yeah so honestly I just want to share my thoughts about um, this trip that um, I really enjoy to go a little bit in the outskirts of Cebu city because it's like so peaceful especially in mountains you feel like the air is so fresh and then it's like re really you, you can unwind and forget about all that uh, stressful city life and that noise and traffic and a lot of people you just uh, like in one click you forget about all of this once you indulge in this like provinces not provinces but I mean the um, small cities and especially in mountains it's so diff it's like uh, what I love what I mean what I love about Cebu that just outside right maybe like 20 to 30 minutes outside of the city if you go to the um, Busai Balamban it's so peaceful here it's like uh, given so much peace of mind so much uh, refreshment So it's already late uh, at night and we just got home recently and then I will show what we uh, bought from the farmers in the, in the mountainside. So it's really very cheap and good. So here we got the dragon fruit. It was also very cheap. Then onions, cabbage, then the roots, ginger, chai, then uh, the sweet corn. So here uh, a lot of a lot of eggplants and um, the soy and then there is many carrots, corn and onion chives and for the herbs we are super excited about this one so there is parsley then dill dill then fresh rosemary 
and mint. Okay, we'll try it. So yeah, wait, Mika. So this is mint. F smell very fresh mint. So I will put it in my tea. All right, and we wish you a good night and say bye bye. bye. Thank you for watching. Bye -bye.